Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, welcome. You came at a pretty odd day, but you still came at a great day regardless. For today's video, I'm gonna be doing a realistic get ready with me for my day job, and it's so realistic to the point where I haven't come, I haven't brushed my hair, so I have to do that. And I'm talking really quickly because I'm actually I was supposed to leave 20 minutes ago, so and now I'm just fighting with time right now. But you know, I just I wanted to show you guys what I do for my face when I go to my day job because you know it's different than what I do in my normal day to day. Even though I still look the same, regardless, <laughs> I still look the same. So yeah, I'm gonna start with primer, and I think today, since I did my skincare already, I think today I'm feeling the this primer. Hold this one, this is hydrogen. Where is it? I'm feeling the perfecting primer from the mare just because I want something that's pore filling. I want something that's gonna make me last throughout the day. Plus, when you see what I put on my face, you'll know why I want something pore filling. So, let's do this. All right, there's the primer. Oh, nothing wrong. Okay, perfect. Feels amazing. This primer always feels amazing. By the way, I'm not going to be talking a lot, and I'm also talking really quiet because it's really early in the morning, and I don't feel like talking that loud. I don't feel like having the same energy, so you know, you know, I'm not playing. This is realistic. All right, my face is primed and ready to go for the day. Now I'm going to be doing a new foundation. I actually haven't showed you guys here on YouTube yet, so I got a foundation because, I got this foundation because... I needed something sheer, I just wanted something sheer, I didn't want something that was, you know, so high maintenance, I didn't want something that I had to, you know, work for it to look good, I didn't want something that I had to, like, put in a little bit more effort for it to look complete, so I got this foundation from Chanel, <laughs> this is the Le Beige, this is the Eau de Tente, which is the water fresh tint, which is supposed to be made up of 75% water, and, like, it has, like, I don't know if you can tell right here, hold on, focus camera, there's like little pigment balls everywhere that like kind of burst on your face to give you like a sheer finish and it comes with like its own itty bitty brush which is supposed to be the only brush you use to like activate the pigments on your face. I don't know if it's true but I still use this brush either way so anyways I just pump like just one and a half pumps for half of my face and then I just pick it up with a brush. That should be good. And then I just layer it on. But yeah, it's a really, really sheer foundation. It's nothing too out of this world. It's nothing too crazy. It's nothing too insane. <laughs> like, I'm gonna look the same. But I will say, this foundation is a really great wake me up in the morning because it feels like I'm just putting like a nice block of ice or like. I just like doused my face in water again <laughs> for the morning. It feels really good. I got me through like half of my face, which is actually really good because <sighs> just trying not to use up a lot. <laughs> I'm trying to keep conversation. I'm trying to wake myself up a little bit too. I haven't had my coffee, so I'm just trying to wake myself up too with some small talk with you guys. How have you been? I know I haven't posted anything since my trip back from those glasses which feels like forever ago but you know I want to get back into the swing of things I want to get back into filming I want to get back into uploading more frequently yeah you see I look the same I want to get back into uploading more frequently just because I feel more creatively inspired plus a lot of things are going to be happening over the next few months because these are the last four months of the year and usually during the last four months of the year is when I start to get super, super busy. Last year was a bit different. This year, I know, is going to be way different because last year, I did not have a day job and I only relied on the clothing brand and my music and YouTube and anything else I did. This year, I do rely on my day job. However, my day job is pretty demanding during this time of the year, although any job is demanding during this time of the year, to be completely honest. And then what I do is also really demanding, so it's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a lot, but I'm up for the challenge. I'm up for the mission, so I'm excited about that. As you can see, very, very sheer. 
very very short it looks like i put nothing on but that's what i want <laughs> like i just want something that's you know gonna make me look refreshed that's gonna make me look like i woke up with nine hours of sleep behind me and that's how i feel and that's how i look plus it lasts all day which i kind of like no i do really like it. so i actually don't do that much concealer, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna do an itty bitty bit of concealer. And when I say an itty bitty bit, I mean like a tiny, tiny bit. So here's another product I purchased, which I have not shown you guys either. I've purchased a lot of things without showing you guys, but I have the Dior Forever Skin Correct, which I didn't think I was gonna like. I love, I love this concealer a lot. It's amazing. And I'm gonna use a lot less than what I normally use just because I don't want it to be too much, like I said. I just want something sheer for like a day job day, so like literally this much. That's it. That's all I'm gonna use on the eye. Oh, I just want something light. Let me just right here. I just pat it on with this brush. Then we do the same to the other eye. There we go. And that's it. Oh my god, like this concealer is amazing. Like this concealer last the whole day and it looks the same the whole day which i really love which i know i mean how am i <laughs> doubting dior's ability to create great makeup because michelle wong loves and raves about this concealer but i had to try it out for myself <laughs> and it works it works amazingly i love it well, i don't do any powder <laughs> i know shocking i don't powder my face a lot for my day job just because i don't like powdering my face a lot so i'm just gonna do this there we go everything's blended and then oh move the camera a little bit and then i just go in with some highlighter some <laughs> it fell i didn't want it to fall it fell. anyways i just going with some highlighter some blush and we call it a day i don't like doing bronzer i don't like doing too much um for the sake of this video i am going to be doing highlighter but i don't do highlighter every day when i go to my day job but just for the sake of the video it's a new dior highlighter which comes in like the nice purse packaging this is the one i bought in los gatos which i told the lady i wanted zero six coral glow she gave me a zero five rosewood glow but i mean whatever i mean it's still a pretty highlighter and i use my pat mcgrath buffer brush because it, it just it gives it a more sheer skin like finish whereas the fenty highlighter brush gives it like this a highlighter kind of finish so i just do a little bit of highlighter this is what the um color looks like by the way i know it looks like it's a little bit deep but it looks really good on my skin i've used it a few times already it looks great so just a little bit just like a sheer, sheer, sheer application. It's a miracle <laughs> I'm doing this video because, oh my god, when I haven't had my coffee, I don't want to do anything, but I'm doing it because I just want to upload something to YouTube and I just don't want it to seem like I abandoned the channel again. <laughs> because last year definitely felt like I abandoned it, but this year I don't want it to feel like I abandoned it. So we're just doing this, like I said, sheer application. Good. Oh, perfect. And now for the final touch is my trusty. It fell again. <laughs> for the finishing touch, it's my trusty, ever loving Hermes blush. Oh my god, I still love this blush to this day. To this day, by the way, guys, I know a lot of people don't like the blush mainly because the packaging isn't heavy enough. There's not enough pigment. It smells. I love all of those things about this blush. I like that it's not too heavy, so if I want to take it with me and touch up, I can take it with me. I love that it's sheer because I don't like something intense. I love that it smells because I, oh, it smells amazing. So, like, all the things people don't like about it, I love about it. Also, I like, I already, like, went through, like, the, um, what's it called, Just through the imprint in a hat, so, you know, I'm grateful for that. Anyways, I don't apply a lot. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Okay, we're just gonna have to see me blush. And 
we're good. I look like I'm blushing. I look like you just gave me the best compliment I've ever received. <laughs> Anyways, we're done. We're done with the makeup and I'm just gonna spray down my face with the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. Let me just do that right here for you guys. There we go. And that's it. That's my makeup for my day job. All I do. There we go. Let me take it to better lighting. Yeah. As you can see. Oh wow, that Dior highlighter though. <laughs> As you can see, it looks like it didn't do anything. But it looks like I did something. Which is the overall goal for this. Anyways, I'm going to end this video here because I do have to go. I really do have to go. So, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below anything else you'd like for me to film. I'm open to ideas. I'm open to things you want me to talk about. I'm open to things you want me to do. I've got the freedom this time around. And subscribe because I'd love to see you guys back here. A lot of things are coming within the next four months. So, get ready. Get excited. I am I know for sure I'm definitely excited. So, Hope you stick around and I'll see you next time for another video.